Right now, Birmingham Mayor William Bell and Councilman Marcus Lundy appear ready to put city business back into their sights. Bell withdrew his formal complaint and the warrant issued against Lundy for third-degree assault that was recalled. In a statement, Bell said that he came to the decision for, quote, the overall good of the city. He added that he wanted to keep up the positive momentum that we have seen over the past several years. Lundy's attorney also released a statement. He said that Lundy regrets the negative impact this entire incident has had on the city. He looks forward to getting back to doing the work that he was elected to do. Of course, this stems from the fight the two men got into at City Hall Tuesday. Bell told police that Lundy got him angry with him during a closed-door meeting outside the council chambers. Bell said that Lundy put him in a chokehold as he tried to leave the room. Now, this fight intensified the divide between the mayor's office and some city council members. If any business is going to get done, the mayor must first find a way to work with the council. As the legislative branch, the council approves projects. The mayor is the executive branch. He signs off on those projects and implements them. Councilwoman Valerie Abbott says it's time for the council and the mayor to work together. Obviously, you can't put a gun to their heads. And if people don't want to, you know, in some cases you have to wait for the voters to vote them out of office. But we don't really want to go to that point. What we want to do is all sit down and give a little, get a little, and hopefully start moving forward again because right now we're dead in the water. The mayor and the council have two years remaining in their current terms. And ABC 3340 has just learned that a group of ministers plan to hold a news conference Thursday morning at city council chambers. The ministers say they plan to work together to help repair relationships, build strategic partnerships, address concerns, and move the city of Birmingham forward.